first time. Good morning! Good morning! Much better. Skipper, I'm going to be your host today aboard the Black Hill. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about the ship, okay? So we'll start with me telling you how it's a four-level ship, meaning we've got four levels. So up top there, we've got the wheelhouse with the main man of the day. Give him a wave, everyone. Morning, Captain. Morning, Captain. This is your driver, Captain Lucas, today. He's going to be sailing us through these lovely seas. It's his first day sailing on the ship all by himself. He's a little bit nervous. I've left the big ball of the bed, going to be absolutely fine. Now behind Lucas from the captain's cabin, we have our sun deck area. So if you want to top up your sun tanks, feel free to go behind there, check it out. Then moving down the stairs to the main deck, we have the smaller of our two large, uh, well, the smaller of our two bars, sorry. We've got two lovely bar winches. Give away morning, ladies. We've got Anna and our lovely Michelle. Now their three favorite words is not I love you, it's keep the change. So please bear that in mind for the day. Now behind the small bar there, we've got our chill out zone. That is a strictly non-smoking area, so please remember that. No smoking behind the upstairs bar. They're moving down here. Two emergency exits on the black dot. One here and one here. <laughs> I hope you can swim. Just kidding. Downstairs to the back of the ship, where you came on this morning, that will be the emergency evacuation point. Should we hit an iceberg, very unlikely, or be boarded by an enemy pirate ship, also pretty unlikely, it could happen, who knows. And these life jackets underneath the seats downstairs, enough for everybody, but not the time to happen, okay? Now, I did mention that we have another bar downstairs, the larger of our two bars, if you can't find what you need up here, such as teas, coffees, ice creams, piratical souvenirs, yeah, you want to get yourself a black t-shirt downstairs, get all that from our lovely bar wedge, Salamia. Um, to the back of the ship also is where you'll find our uh, accessible toilet. So downstairs to the back of the ship, it's a little toilet to the left hand side. Uh, anybody with any walking difficulties, anything like that, you can ask for the key at the bar downstairs and then give it back once you've finished. And that is also where you'll find the baby changing facility. Now the way that works is you go in there with your baby, you change it for another one. That will be on the and then for the rest of you, go back to my chest downstairs, right to the middle of the ship, there's a door either side, you follow that down again, and that is the truth there. Quite self-explanatory, I won't go into that too much. You hit water when you go down. Okay, now, my name is Skipper, your host, as I said. We do have some other crew members aboard. Perhaps you want to meet them, maybe a certain special character. Jack Sparrow, anyone want to meet Jack Sparrow? Yay! Yeah. Yeah. You sure? Well, I don't mean to disappoint you. I did see him before downstairs. He was on the floor. Pull the bottom next to him. He had a bit of a heavy 99 hand clap. It does that to you sometimes. But we're going to wake up the captain. We're going to make some noise. We're going to shout, scream, wave our arms in the air, hit the tables, hit the person next to you, and make a big push. The captain's fire up. Look at everyone. Three, two, one. Come on, wake up, Jack. Where are you? I want to do Jack. Help me out. Come on. Sit the people. Anybody see him? Ah, morning Skipper. Morning, this is uh, my good friend. I need to tell you something. Before you get up there, sir. What's he doing here? What else is he about to say? You know this is my ship. Go on, fire off, shoot. Shoot him in the face. I'm going to shoot you in your face. It's a bit extreme, boys. Put your weapons away. The weapons box fine. I know. Who are all these people? I was just about to explain that, Jack, before you were able to look Well, you are tempted. Who are they? This is the new crew that you asked for, Jack. I didn't ask for the crew. Yes, he did. When he wanted to be in Castle Club last night, he said, Skip Get me a new crew. Here they are. I don't like them. I don't like them either. You don't like them? Let's get rid of them. Well, all of them? Well, we'll start with one. Which one? But, uh, I don't know. This one right here. You, all these cuts. Come on. What's wrong with the big guy? Oh, you're good. Yeah. Shoot. Shoot. Come on. 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 Come on.
Okay, so uh, here's the crew. Let's find out where the crew's from. We're gonna shout out to some quick crew. Alright there, alright scumbags. Next time don't wait, buy a ticket. If you can land on the boat from there, you get a free ticket. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry, hard time. Give a big wave and say hi, tourists. All right, so three, two, one. Hi, hi. tourists. There we go. All right. The route only one way back. Uh -huh. Sorry, didn't see it. The water looks quite white today. So we're going to find out where we're going from. Yes, I know, I definitely know we've got some people from Poland on board today. Poland makes make some noise. noise. Poland. Poland. Thank you. Thank you. A little bit of a delay there, but we got that. So, so um, anyone from Romania? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what about Sweden? Oh, there they are, the Vikings. Uh, no way! No way. No way. There is. No way. Estonia. Finland. Finland. Yeah. Oh, excellent. Uh, oh, I'm running out of quick. Scotland. Too fast. Too fast. We have got enough help. Anyone from Wales? There's a milk up there. I'm going to tell you what I speak of. Yeah, it's very good. Good morning. I'm going to send that. I thought it was lambing season. What are you doing here, Jack? Ireland! Repeat the question. Northern Ireland! They can find a bit of money. England! Yeah. 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 North of England! South of England. The middle bit. Oh no. Georgia. Hey. Have we missed anyone? Oh no, Israel. We hey. really make more noise than that. Go on. Germany. How could we forget Germany? Austria. Yeah. France. <laughs> Netherlands! Anywhere else? Have we missed anybody? Switzerland! Yeah. Stop it! They're always on the fence. So it's into Eurovision. Eurovision. That's coming up soon. Eurovision. Okay, uh, if we have missed anybody, I'm very sorry. You've had the opportunity to, to shout it out. But, um, so we've got three golden rules aboard the Black Pearl. Three golden rules. Jack. You're the captain, you tell them the rules. I am going to tell them the rules. We've got three golden rules, which you must apply by at all times. Rule number one, there can be no running from the depths of the girl because you can run. And you can fall over. What I like to do. I will. And I've got a very weak leg, haven't I? Yeah, very yeah. Ironically, when you run, you fall over, he starts laughing, he wets himself, and he thinks it's a very, very, very important rule. So pay attention to it. Right then, we're all going to go through it, no flashing the toilet paper, down the toilet. The toilet is on You may end up by the one special guest who lives up there in the ring and says she is... Victoria Becker! Downstairs, seriously, within the next 15 minutes, okay? What will happen is they'll give you a little yellow ticket and at lunchtime you can eat the ticket. <laughs> no, no, no. They'll cook you a nice vegetarian meal, but in all seriousness, you do need to let them know within the next 15 minutes, just so they make sure it's ready for lunchtime, okay? So let them know in the next 15 minutes, ticket, vegetarian. Your rabbit food, rabbit food. What rabbit food? Oh, Skittles. 
Okay, do we have any celebrations on board? Any birthdays? Skip her! Now our, our skipper here is the most of all the black girl. Yeah, so if there is any missing about the little people, I'll just slap it. So go child line out here, no more silver. But that goes for the big people as well, yeah. Yeah, they have a wet downstairs. So you look like you could be a bit in trouble. Yeah, there's a wet downstairs, a wet downstairs. Oh Hector here is seven for seven seats. Myself, Captain Hector, Captain Jack, we're gonna come around. With some black paper and some chalk, and you're going to design your very own pirate flag. So if we do see an enemy pirate ship in the distance, you wave your flag and we all shout "Yar!" and it scares us right off and works a treat every single time. Okay? Now we have a board in the back which we're going to bring out and show you. If you're struggling for something uh, to think of something to draw, we've got some inspiration with some real pirate flags from history. But you can draw absolutely anything you like, anything you want. In fact, you can draw Captain Jack Sparrow and eat any passport photograph. Uh, we're going to come around with some chalk and paper. Step one. I would trade it, here we go. different flavors. That's why we have only white left. Thank you. 